everyone welcome back with another video of cybrosis in this video we will show you how to generate the patna ledger report that you can see inside the accounting module of uru 80 so it's basically very helpful to easily track your customer and vendor balance using patna ledger report okay so let me say why partner ledger matters and why we are giving that much importance to a partner ledgers. Okay. So the partner ledger report help you to review, I mean, view detailed financial transaction for each customer or vendor. So it's basically very essential for monitoring outstanding balances, tracking invoice of payment, managing supplies bill and as well as keeping your financial record transparent and up to date. Okay. So this is very important uh, while we are checking on the accounting module of Oru. So without wasting any time, let's directly move to the accounting module first. So once you open the accounting module, let's head over to the reporting session. Under the partners report there, you will see the partner ledger. Okay, just click on there and you will get uh, this kind of a dashboard. Okay, so let me explain each and everything starting from the bottom side, I mean top side. Uh, there you can simply select a desired date range to analyze a specific period very really easily. So that shows here, here you can see this a specific period which is 2025 and you can simply adjust the date by specifying this uh, option uh, which you can specify uh, your month, year and everything. And there we have different kinds of what filters as well as okay. So, this filters is basically focus on specific partners, account type, whether it's a receivable or a payable. Once you click the traders partner, there you will see the receivable or payable. And also, you can simply filter uh, by the journals or a companies. Okay. So, once you have clicked the partner, there you can specify the partner and add a tag here. And you can simply filter by the post entries, which is trapped entries, uh, unreconciled entries, unfold all and everything. And you can also filter using the partner ledger, customer statement and follow-up report as well as, okay. So that's the importance of the main filters, I mean main uh, smart buttons that you can see on the top of this dashboard, okay. And let's uh, come back to the main thing, which is this uh, wizard, okay. So what are the things that you can see or what the report displays? First of all, that you can see the partner's name, which is Azure Interior Sticko, Edic Gemini, Furniture, Lights Up, Open Board, Ready Mat, and Unknown Partner, as well as a gift. So, once you flick this add, you will uh, see an expanded version of this. Okay, let me do one more thing. Okay. So, here you can see the expanded version of this Azure Interiors, whether what are the things that happened under the Azure Interiors and everything. Every, uh, each and every explained detail will be here. And you can simply go to the partner side and as well as the journal items by clicking on this two option. Okay. So here you can see the partner's name. Oh, all right. So let's move back to the partner's ledger. I accidentally click on something else. Okay. So next what we can see. You can simply see the individual transaction details like invoice payment. Then you can see invoice payment, journal entries and everything. Okay. And there we have the debit, credit and balance column as well as there you can see the three columns. This provides a clear view of what each partner's owes or is owed. Okay. So you can see these things. Okay. Now let's uh, talk about how to analyze customer and vendor balance very easy. So uh, from the customer side or for customer, we can see that um, we can simply review outstanding invoice and payment received very easily. Okay. At full vendor, we can track unpaid supplies bill and payment made very easily. Okay. So that's what you can uh, simply understand from this particular dashboard. And you can also do one more thing, which you can simply export this um, particular report into a PDF or an XLSS format. So using the partner's ledger report in Odoo, it's basically help you to stay organized and manage your customer and vendor balance effectively. So stay productive to avoid overdue payments and ensure accurate bookkeeping. So that's all about this video. So, if you found this tutorial helpful, please like, subscribe and leave a comment below. So, I'll be back with another video. Till that, bye-bye.